Mm-hmm. See, men don't commit to a woman unless she has convinced him to convince himself. And that's the same thing with women. Women right. get men that cheat on them and say, oh, he's a dog, he ain't no good, and you hooked on him. Yeah, but you convinced yourself to trust that dog that was not trustworthy. Right. right. Mm. Well, we got a man on the phone. You tell me. Yeah, do all men cheat for well, folks now? Well, um, I can only, you know, based on myself, I I did cheat in the past. And um, but that was because I was venturing out and everything. Um, one thing I believe in is you don't want to be locked down too early because you need to um, venture out and do your thing. Overall, because um, we don't have much time. No, definitely all men do not cheat. I mean, there are bad apples and you know there are good ones. Yeah. Um, we um, this is the uh, probably our earliest our earliest show we had uh, uh, probably the first show we had was. Uh, why do men cheat or whatever, and yeah. um, I gave the reasons why. But I did say, um, no, not all men cheat. I mean, you know, we're but we are as um, uh, as flexible as our um, uh, uh, as our we're uh, we're as strong as our options are. I mean, if the door is open, then mm-hmm. we we might we might take it, we might not. But I I for one, you know, I've been in um, um, the past relationships that I've been into. No, I haven't cheated. You know. So, you know, I could okay, say okay. I could say no, they don't. Okay, well everybody disagree. I think they all do. <laughs> Maybe I'm a pessimistic, but I think they all do. I mean, like I mean it's a it's a competitive world and it's it's hard to be a woman, it's hard to be a black woman because um of it, you know, the 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 things the, the the things you have to climb, but you, you, although I, but you know why I say that is because our society is so dripping with sex, and there's always there's oh, always yeah. a woman who's willing to sleep with a man who's attached, and a man is always going to me it's always like they seem like they're so caught up in the physical and and mm-hmm. so out of control that even there's a good always, man would would tiptoe out. There's always one woman who just don't give a fuck. And you know they'll want to do whatever. And that that is true. But however, all men do not cheat. You know, okay. Not, not, okay. they they do not. I mean, I mean there are some there are women who are cheat. You know, let's put the marrow yeah. on your. You know, there are women yeah. who are who who will cheat. But you know, as far as do all men cheat? Negative. Okay. Now there's some pussies out here that could that make a man leave them other pussies alone. I'm sorry, but they yes, they are. are. Yes, yes, they are. Oh, oh we they popping. We got a caller. We better yeah. they popping. They talk too. Hey, oh, y'all, yeah. we got, you you there, caller? <laughs> you there, caller? Yeah, peace, queen. Um, I, I wanted to uh, speak on the uh, on something else. You know, I just wanted to get your opinion. I wanted to just speak on. Uh, you know, his, this low life, the Negro R. Kelly, and you know other cases. This I want to just say on on these other cases on how the black woman is just abused. Because I was I was looking at something old from when uh, the the situation the Mike Tyson got in with the with the young lady, and you know I just it really didn't sit well with me how they did her. You know because we know it was evidence to support both, but why? You know I just think that well, I know why, but it's it just I want to get your how, how hard that is for you know when a black woman comes up. Uh, being bringing charges like that, you know, just how the, she's attacked and just be little and, yeah. and sing. Cause I I see another YouTube video where a girl, you know, with with the low life, the R. Kelly Negro who who would do that to a young girl and just you know and just walk away scot free. Where a, a young lady had said that she was there and present and participated, and people just was berating her and just putting her down. And I, and I think that's just horrible. But, mm-hmm. but you know these Negroes to do these to these black women who come forward with these stories and backed up by evidence. I want you know I just want to know an opinion on how these little like the Negroes do that to, to the black women of the community who are are actually being abused. No, I agree with you. I think I saw that you were talking about on BET a couple of nights ago where she's done changed her identity, had plastic surgery and shit. Mm, yeah, Who's the R. Kelly victim? No, uh, Mike Tyson. That girl still. Oh, Desiree. Yeah, she Desiree Watson. Yeah, she changed yeah. everything because she don't want. 
Uh, which tells me, obviously, she was very weak and emotionally fragile. If she's out all these years and she still cannot have the courage to stand up and believe in herself, although she was very humiliated and degraded and he did go to jail, that tells me she already had some other issues and some father issues, too. And she did put herself in that position. I'm not saying she deserved to be raped because I heard that he raped a lot of other women. He saw women as pieces of meat, and I can see in, the, in this industry why he did because there are so many women that do care of themselves as pieces of meat, and they do prostitute themselves to try to get to a celebrity or get a baby or think he's going to marry them or pick them. But as I had said earlier, we were talking about this. This society has been designed to disrespect, humiliate, and ignore the woman and see her as something inferior to be dominated and used and ejaculated on. And then the black woman especially has been the one, although she is first, she's the oldest one here. She's the first one that was ever created. All races came out of her because she doesn't know that she's divine, because she doesn't know who she is, she is because she doesn't realize that she's not a second, third, or fourth class citizen, because she doesn't know that all races were created out of her womb. Her DNA is the oldest female DNA ever found on the planet. That's why she gets played like that, because her man doesn't remember past being in shackles and chains. That's why he's sees her like that because he sees himself that way. He doesn't respect her so because he don't see himself as a king god. He is dead to the knowledge of his own divinity. And that's why, because women don't realize that when we look at these men as gods, as superstars, and put them on pedestals, we don't know who we are, and we're looking at them, we think they're going to give us something. We think they're going to illuminate our consciousness. We think they're going to save us or resurrect us in some kind of way. We think they're going to heal us. But instead, they hinder, they crucify, they hurt us, they even sabotage and kill us. So I see this is going on, and then, like you said, sex is everywhere, porn is everywhere. Mm -hmm. You know, there's a real deep, significant message when a man can piss. Like they say, R. Kelly pissed on these girls, and he yes. ejaculated on these girls. You know, when a man will give out his seed like that and ejaculate on a woman's face, in her mouth, on in her butt, uh, on her vagina instead of in it, and he's giving his seed away, you know, there's a really deep message and a deep sense of loss, too, when a man can give his sperm away. And our women are consenting that. We think there's something cute and nice when a man will ejaculate on your face, ejaculate in your mouth, uh, ejaculate in your rectum, and not ejaculate in your vagina and then piss and shit on you and eat piss and shit. Yeah, we have a lot of black women doing that as well as fucking horses and fucking dogs, letting dogs ejaculate in their mouth, ejaculate in oh, their vagina. God. See, we have fallen uh. that low. So mm -hmm. to look at him, I think it's degrading and disgusting, but I already know he's lost. Many of these entertainers are lost with their money and their yeah. degrees. They lost yeah. because yeah. we are lost because we are participating in this very mm -hmm. vicious cycle. So he ejaculated her, her, the court system ejaculated on her, society ejaculated on her, said she wasn't shit. She folded yeah. and believed she was supposed to be ejaculated on, and now she done went into hide and living like a coward, changed her name, changed her face because she forgot she was divine. Yeah. Y'all, we got to go. We only got one minute. I'm asking everybody that's listening wow. to rate the show because it will help mm -hmm. make my show popular. If you rate my show, if you want me to come to your town, text VP Tour to 62900 and text yes if you want me to come to your town. Also, join my vaginapower.ning.com site. I love everybody being here. Thank you so much for supporting me. I'm going to be back Saturday night, and I'm going to be back next Wednesday night doing powerful shows. And I just appreciate everybody. Just rate my show, leave comments, send me your questions. And I, I'm just so glad at last minute so many people showed up. Thank you so much for being here. I enjoyed it. Everybody it was a beautiful show. <laughs>